Thanks for the call. Let's go out to uh, 504. Please state your name and where you're calling from. Your line is open, and you are next. 504, it's your turn. Hey, my name is Doc David Edwards, and uh, thank you for giving me the opportunity to speak with you. I have a question for Mr. Mezzer at all. Do you regret the fact that this is on the five Can you talk up? Speak up. Hey, Mr. Mr. Mezzer, do you regret the fact that the 2005 trial was not televised? And can you you know, I apologize. I'm, 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 on, I'm, on a, I'm on a street, and let me just try. And I'm having trouble hearing you. Uh, I'll, I'll let me about, move my location. Go ahead. Yeah. But do you wish that the 2005 trial would have been televised? And can you imagine how different the media coverage would have been had the trial been televised? I, I, you know, I'm, I'm embarrassed to say I'm having trouble he hearing said, uh, you. Talk do you he said, his question was, Tom, uh, do you, can you imagine if your trial was televised and how the media would have reacted if the trial was well, televised? Well, you know, if it were televised, the public would have seen both sides. They would have seen the direct examination by the prosecution of their witnesses, and they would have seen the cross-examination by the defense as it, as it went down, what would happen was the, the media people who were against us were watching the direct examination, which was very similar to the kind of witness examination that occurred in the grand jury room where again, there was no judge and no defense attorney present. And as soon as they heard the direct examination, they were running out to report it and not waiting to see what the defense did. And I can honestly tell you that the defense cross-examination of these witnesses was devastating. One after another, they were being proven to lack credibility, to be exaggerating. I mean, it just, uh, it was like dominoes falling. Now, had it been televised, you would have seen that. But on the other hand, witnesses would have also seen what other witnesses were saying. And I really did not want that to happen. Um, I had my own strategy involved. I prepared my cross-examinations with a clear strategy, and I didn't want prosecution witnesses turning on the tube and watching what other witnesses said before they got on the stand. I didn't want family members, your Viso family, watching what others said before they got up to testify. So I was against having everything televised. There were some other reasons why I didn't want it televised, too. But the answer to the question is the public would have seen what the defense was doing more than they were able to see by just listening to the biased media. Hey, thank you. That's an excellent analysis. I really appreciate that. I know it's all about okay, that. Okay, well, thanks for calling. Thank you.